The Kaduna State House of Assembly has set up a 13-man committee to probe the financial dealings, loans, grants and other project implementations from 2015 to 2023 under former Governor Nasir El Rufai's tenor. The House also mandated the committee to invite notable personalities that served during the period, including contractors, to explain how the loans and grants received during the period and the review were spent. The Chairman House Committee on Public Accounts, who is also the Deputy Minority Whip, Honorable Mag Mugu Yusuf, moved the motion saying the public needed to know what actually happened during that period. According to him, he moved the motion following the comment made by the State Governor Uba Sani on March 28, 2024, on the financial situation of the state. He also said statistics showed that Kaduna debt profile was second next to Lagos out of the 36 states. He said if a state reached a position where payment of salary became a problem, then such a situation was a serious matter. Should be on, should be on there are rules and process. Be it the Speaker and leadership and members of the House with the total majority of the members of the House will approve the loan and appropriate the funds and monitor the funds and monitor the projects implemented or appropriated as granted by the Constitution. We go back to the Chairman, Commission Minister, where I am the Chairman of that committee. Some of this loan was collected to service the metropolis. Now all the project is stagnant, nothing is going on. And look at the quantum of loan, the quantum of money that was collected to service this state. But it's been interesting to know that at the course of our exercise, when we invite some of our contractors, we we'll come to land that they cannot sell the government. It's only some of our contracts will certificate of completion at hand over 100 million now. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.